Hi everyone, it's Bea Devine and uh, welcome. Thank you so much for being here. I hope you're happy and well wherever you are. Now this is uh, for the single people um, who want to see who the best partner is for them or what would be most suited to them. Okay, so I'm going to just do my best to guide you with that. I'm actually going to use uh, Lenormand cards for this process okay and uh, the Lenormand, Lenormand cards in themselves will give you a ton of information um, and probably a lot more than even tarot does with this kind of question okay so uh, for number one uh, this is going to be uh, what to look out for who's the best type of person to be in a relationship with you of course this is just a guide you don't want to live by the, the cards, okay? All right, so let's have a look what comes out and I will always trust. Okay, so this is someone. All right, so the best characteristic uh, for you, number one, is someone who's calm, someone who's uh, very gentle, very loving, that kind of thing. Um, also, maybe that they keep to themselves. Uh, someone who's probably been through a lot of things like you have as well. Um, and when you meet this person, it's like uh, you don't have to ask any questions. And I always say that to people, if you're asking questions about your relationship, is this the right person for me? Then deep down you already know, right? So this is saying that this person will come, uh, you know, the perfect person for you, sorry, is someone that is connected with a peaceful life. They don't want any dramas. They don't want to um, have all this stress. So having stress around you is no good. You'll need this calm energy. Also, it shows me that there's a sensation of um, loving history and ancient artifacts and, you know, looking at amazing wonders of the world and the pyramids and, you know, like Egyptian stuff as well. Um, and also maybe living in uh, a cabin in the woods where no one's around, right? So this particular energy is is more the quiet uh, type, but also someone very smart, someone who uh, does things very carefully, someone who's very thoughtful, right? Because we all need that and want that. And someone who also is very spiritual. Otherwise, it's going to be really difficult for you guys to be able to connect. So for number one, this is some of the attributes of the most ideal partner. They may also be that little bit more older um, or maybe just a little bit more mature uh, than the average age of what they would normally be in that sort of age group. You know, so you might get an 18 year old, but they're more mature. Um, okay, so beautiful. Those are the sorts of things to be looking out for. Um, regardless.